Uh, okay, so I'm running this uh, application on my Android phone. So I'm not connected to, to the internet and I got a message not connected. Now I'm going to connect to a Wi-Fi and uh, I'm going to run this application one more time. And just a second. Okay, I got a message connected to Wi-Fi and now I'm going to disconnect from the Wi-Fi and connect to my mobile network. And now let's uh, run application again. And we got a message connected to mobile. So that's it. Pretty much easy, right? Uh, hello guys and uh, welcome to another video of mine. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to check if your device is connected to either mobile or Wi-Fi network or uh, if, you're connect if your device is uh, connected uh, to internet uh, after all. So first we're going to, uh, to modify this text view in our uh, activity main XML file. We're going to add the uh, text size and text color attributes here. And uh, now we're going to uh, add two booleans. One uh, a boolean variable will name the Wi-Fi wi connected and the other mobile connected. Next, we're going to add the text view. And uh, after that, we're going to find the ID of our text view. Um, next, what we're going to do, we're going to create a new uh, class or method. Uh, we'll name it uh, check network connection. It will be a method. Uh, so uh, inside, we're going to create uh, connectivity uh, manager object we will name that object connectivity manager and now we are going to use uh, get system service method and pass the parameter uh, context dot um, connectivity service like that uh, after that, we're going to uh, create a network info object. Uh, we'll name it network info. And we're going to use a connectivity manager object to get uh, active uh, network info. Uh, so we're going to add permission, uh, access network state, inside our uh, Android manifest file, like that. Okay, now that we have added permission, um, we're going to create an uh, if-else block. So if uh, network uh, info uh, is not null and if uh, connectivity manager or no, if network info, uh, no. It's not a method in, network, in connectivity manager, so sorry about that. Just uh, type network info dot is connected, and if those two uh, are true, then we are going to create something, and else we are going to create something as well. So let's start the first block. If block, we'll say uh, Wi-Fi connected equals to network info dot get type and uh, equals to connectivity manager dot type Wi-Fi so we're going to uh, pass this boolean value in our Wi-Fi connected uh, boolean and we'll do the same for our uh, second boolean mobile connected we're going to pass the value of uh, if network info type is equals to type uh, mobile um, like that and uh, we're going to create uh, uh, we're going to set uh, our booleans uh, to false at first so we're going to separate those two uh, variables here equals to false and uh, again private boolean mobile connected will be equals to false at the beginning 
Okay, now that we have that, uh, we can create another if block inside if block. So if Wi-Fi connected is equals is true, then we are going to set the text to our text view. And uh, we're going to say, let's say, connected to Wi-Fi. Uh, else, if uh, mobile connected is true, then we'll say text view connected to mobile. Like that. And uh, in else block, we'll set uh, no not connected to internet or not connect and then we're going to use our method in uh, on create uh, method and there we go uh, now let's try our application I think we uh, have it all here so uh, we used connectivity manager and network info to get uh, our uh, network information whether it's, a, it's our device connected to Wi-Fi or mobile. And uh, we're going to simply display a text uh, on our text view for uh, each of those, uh, each of those uh, scenarios. Uh, thank you for watching guys uh, and uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and see you in the next video.